serious form and the leading marksman in the league. Can he add to his total today? Hello and welcome to the south coast of England. We're here at the Amex Stadium. My name is Derek Ray and sitting alongside me in the commentary position is the former Arsenal and West Ham midfield player Stuart Robson. And with the Premier League season about to reach its conclusion, we're just minutes away from kickoff time. It's Brighton facing Manchester City. Well, what a season it's been, Derek. We've seen everything. Drama at both ends of the table, some spectacular goals and plenty of entertainment. The players, of course, will be looking forward to... Oh, a good timing save. Well, they won't get too many chances, so they need to make the most of this. Who's going to get on the end of it? Well cleared away. Now shot happy here, and no way through. And a look at the starting 11 for Manchester City. Emerick Laporte plays alongside Nathan Ake in central defence. Riyad Mahrez plays with Jack Grealish in the wide positions. And lining up through the middle in attack today, Erling Haaland. Well, doesn't have to do it on his own. He read the situation defensively and did his job. Well, we can say it officially now. We'll be watching the champions today. The title secured in the last match. What a terrific position to be in, Stuart. Well, they can certainly enjoy this one, Derek. What a great season they've had. They've been the best team in the league. No doubt about that for me. Mares. Determined defending. That's useful play. That's a foul, and it will be a potentially dangerous free kick. And he succeeds in striping it off the line. Well, a goal to let you know about in the Southampton game. Here's Alex. Yeah, it's a goal for Spurs. They've scored the opener here with 15 minutes played. Thanks as always, Alex. He's in here. Firing it in. The keeper diving magnificently to make sure he got there. Well, it has to come soon. They're creating so many chances. Just listen to the noise inside here. Who can they pick out? Terrific save from the keeper. Well, that's just a wonderful save. How did he stop that? Not the result from the set piece they were looking for. Gross. He got in the way of that cross. Promising sequence. Will he play it in? And the cross not quite accurate enough. He's in behind. And there to intervene. Throw in coming up for Brighton. And let's join Alex Scott because I hear a goal has gone in in the Southampton match. Thank you, Alex. And over it comes. Not the best clearance. Well, they can't quite take advantage in the end. Could be a chance to break here. Well, they couldn't take advantage of the opportunity. Grealish. On to De Bruyne. And there's the feed into the box. A decisive clearance it was. 
Mitoma. On to Gilmore. And an astute piece of defending. Foden. Gundogan. Well, as the stats confirm, City have controlled the ball. But unless they find some inspiration from somewhere, I'm not sure where the winner will come from. They certainly... Oh, could be! Well, the keeper has outdone himself. Wonderful save. Kevin De Bruyne with the corner. And the problem not completely solved. High degree of difficulty to hit it on the volley like that. And it was close. Well, his skill level is so high. You're absolutely right. That's a great effort on the volley. They might be able to get in now. And he's in. Just missing narrowly on the volley. Well, it's a fantastic effort. Difficult technique, but he caught it so well. He's unfortunate. Now they're on the scent of something positive. A good and fair challenge. This might be ideal for the counter. An incisive pass. Could it be? And a goal! Now they have their opener, and now they can celebrate. Well, here it is again, and the pace in which they break forward is devastating. It's so hard to defend against. And then the strike from Grealish. He never looked like missing, did he? Brilliant finish. So, underway again here. 1-0 the score. Levi Garcia... And not quite accurate enough, Stuart. Well, I think he should do better there. But at least they're now knocking at the door. And the electronic board delivers the news. Two minutes of stoppage time. Phil Foden. Gundogan. And now it's Phillips. Well, the referee blows the whistle. And... So back underway here into the second half. Walker. To Brainer now. Grealish. But a crucial intervention inside the box. De Bruyne. Top class defending. Can they do something positive on the counter attack? Course. Oh, fine play, and maybe it'll set something up. March. Can he finish? Superb block. In the corner kick it is. What can they do with this one? So they look for inspiration. Here it is now, a substitution. And that is a defender doing his job, clearing it off the line. And both hands on it, good goalkeeping. Did well to win the ball back. I must say, this looks promising. Oh, great vision. Rose. Must be. And they've done it to square the game once again. 
Exhilarating. Well, as you can see, he doesn't mess about here, does he? He's strong, well-balanced and skillful. That's a top-class finish. So back underway, they've levelled it at 1-1 here. Well, there's been speculation out there for a while now, but if the rumours are to be believed, Real Madrid may be about to get their man, Stuart. Well, the report suggests a figure of about £85 million, which seems slightly excessive to me, but is it good enough for them to let him go? Only time will tell. Well, we're into the final half hour. Kevin De Bruyne. And now it's Phillips. Walker. Laporte. Grealish. It's with Gundogan. They've regained possession. But a goal to let you know about in the Newcastle game. Over to Alex for the details. It's another for Newcastle United. They're ahead by two now with 65 minutes play. Cheers, Alex. Well, this could pose problems for the defenders. And the cross not quite imaginative enough. And collected tidily. He had plenty to think about. A lot of live football to come right here on EA TV. And I very much hope you can join us for this game. Well, that should be a really good game between two entertaining teams in a great stadium. Well, he really wants his brace. Well, he looks so bright today. His movement has been excellent. Can someone get on the end of this? Uh, no problem. Problems at all for the keeper. Well, as you can see, they've done everything in terms of creativity. They just need to finish one of these chances off to take the lead. Yes, you definitely get that feeling as they go to work once more. Good use of advantage by the referee. McAllister. Could take the lead. And with that, they've thwarted the opportunity. Breaking at pace. All in all, a broken counter-attack. Lalana. Well, he had a lot of ground to cover. Splendid. Day. Well, this is a big moment, and don't these fans know it? And Manchester City going to the bench. A double substitution here. Malana. Oh, a vital interception. And the keeper not thinking it through. Great reflex action. Well, that should have been a goal. Mind you, it's a brilliant save. See how it affects the match. Who can they pick out? Biragi. A really vital interception. 
Not a goal to tell you about in the United match. Alex Scott. It's a goal for Palace. The shot was ferocious and it went in off the woodwork. They've pulled one back and now trail by one with 79 minutes played. Alex keeping us right up to date. Holland. Manchester City still on the attack as the minutes tick away. Can they come up with a winner? Levi Garcia. I must say, this looks promising. Lalana. Untidy on the ball. Five minutes left. Well, a nearly moment just over the top. Holland. Bernardo Silva sliding it through. Oh, really commanding goalkeeping. Well, what a final few minutes we have here. And the fans are certainly playing their part. But can they take one of these chances that come their way and win this game? Can they push ahead on the closing stages? Oh, tremendous header that time. But the goalkeeper was there. Well, this forthcoming corner might just do it. Could be the last chance to hit the front in the dying moments. Oh, splendid header, but a fine save. So it's going to be a goal kick here. Sergio Gomez. And so that will be all for today. And no winners. It does go down as a draw. The Manchester City performance. What would your assessment be? Well, Derek, they are normally the better team, but that wasn't the case today because it was a below-par display and they just have to switch their focus to the next match now. Well, this man has given us plenty of reasons to dwell on his performance, hasn't he, Stuart? Well, I think he'll be pleased with his overall performance. When they were struggling, he was the one to step up and it's a key goal, that.